All right, for your viewing pleasure, Isaac will do this one for us. Okay. I got you. So, you have three zeros right there, right there, and right there. So there's the three zeros. And then, since there's numbers after the one, so it's like 1.55 times 10. And since there's three zeros, you can just know that that's what the power is going to be for the 10, no matter what. Negative 3. And why is it negative again? Because it's three zeros in front of the number. Oh, okay. That's interesting. That's how I do it. That's very good. That's very good. That is the answer. Just be careful because if we look closer at it, these, you move the decimal three times because in some cases, right, uh, we won't show this zero right here. And uh, that may throw you off. So don't let it. Just know that you're going to move it three times.